good afternoon me and uh, nidhi the way uh, deal with the comparative literature a critical uh, introduction 1939 introduction what is a comparative literature today uh, uh, susan uh, besson abstract <laughs> there have been a, a various uh, definition of the comparative literature which are greatly uh, various from one scholar to the another but they all uh, agree that it is uh, one of the most modern uh, literary science uh, throughout the past two decades new critical theories such as a gender based criticism translation study deconstruction and orientalism have changed approach to literature and accordingly have had a profound impact on the work of the comparist sooner or later any anyone who claims to the working in comparative literature has to try and answer the in vitiable question what is it the simplest an answer is that a comparative literature involves to the study of text across uh, culture that uh, in uh, inter disciplinary and that uh, it is uh, uh, considered with the patterns of connection in literature across both time and uh, space and matthew arnold says uh, every there is a connection everywhere there is uh, illustrations and according to the susan basson every body who is interested uh, in book looks in the one uh, uh, one of the path to comparative literature a comparative analysis you should have already already hit the different uh, prominent writers for instance chaucer shakespeare uh, brutalan pop and uh, joyce he <coughs> argument a uh, comparative literature uh, revolves around the study of literature outside the borders of one uh, particular culture uh, that a study of a relation between literature on the one hand and other areas of human experience such as a philosophy on the other hand critics have also related it to history as to explain to the uh, converges uh, junction of the different literatures and his uh, historical aspect of uh, influence considering the comparative literature is the essence of the history of literature beyond the scope of one uh, culture or language another argument is the <clears throat> is there west student of 1960 claim that comparative literature could be put a single boundaries of comparative literature study but she says that there is no uh, particular method used for a uh, climbing critics at the end of the 20th century in the age of po uh, post modernism still uh, wrestled uh, with <coughs> the some question that were posed more than a country ago some critics are a question about about what is the object of the study in comparative literature how can compare uh, be the object of uh, anything if a individual literature have a canon what might a comparative canon be and how can be comparist select what to compare is a comparative literature a disclaim or it is the simply a field of a study <coughs> uh, intro, uh, introduction the what is a comparative literature today uh, is a book, a book the written by susan uh, besnet he said that the most uh, of the people uh, most of the people do not uh, start with the comparative literature uh, but they uh, end up with Uh, with in uh, some way or other uh, generally we uh, uh, generally we first start uh, reading uh, the text and then we arrive the comparison i mean to say we start uh, comparing that the text with another uh, the uh, similarity and dissimilarity compared to uh, literature emerge in a 19th century <clears throat> another say uh, say the matthew and arnold uh, is the comparative literature is the different uh, from uh, national literature general literature and the world literature it is to the begin literature compare in a uh, 1960 in uh, germany and the comparative literature got uh, 
recognizing uh, as a study in 1897 matthew arnold is a uh, have a uh, in uh, lecture at the oxford in uh, 1857 when he said that uh, everywhere there is a connection every where there is a illustration no a single event no single literature is adequately a uh, comprehensive expert in relation to the other event uh, to the other literature and uh, other critics the romanticism are, are there is a uh, as a uh, weekend upon uh, weekend uh, upon, upon the uh, bosco while uh, reading chaucer shakespeare uh, primary materials uh, may, uh, may be treated back to the latin french uh, spanish and italian we can see uh, we can see have a uh, bocasio uh, uh, essentially for uh, edgar allan poe insulin his own writing considered how many english author uh, learned from the great russian writer of the 19th century another may uh, compare uh, james joy uh, borrowing and uh, leading to to italian uh, savios uh, uh, clarice uh, lepstroker uh, reminds uh, use the jane rush who is turned to remind us of uh, uh, judge uh, brands and uh, anias nen and an another critic his uh, got uh, is uh, give the terms of world literature uh, uh, world literature to comparative literature because the comparative literature removes the all borders and bring uh, nearer to all literature and spread harmony and uh, in another another say uh, he uh, said that the in a question uh, 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 previous question i discussed the the great money other question refused to go away in since uh, in since 1950 we have been hearing all too frequently about the rene velenk define the compare uh, the crisis of the comparative literature another the comparative literature as a term seems uh, to the strong patients both for the against as uh, early uh, 1930 uh, bentrock uh, crotches argued that the comparative literature was a non subjective uh, uh, non subjective comparatively distinguished the suggestion that it might be the seen as a separate uh, distinct he he discussed the definition of comparative literature as uh, exploration and the we, uh, we studies uh, alternation development uh, uh, develop, developments and the uh, recropal uh, uh, difference uh, difference uh, differences and the theme of and the literary ideas across the literature Uh, across the literature and the conclude that the, there is uh, no study more uh, right than the research of of this sort An- another he is uh, he he suggest that the proper object of the sh- uh, study should be the literary history the comparative uh, uh, history of uh, of a literature uh, a literature is a history und- understood in uh, in its uh, true sense as a uh, and complete explanations of the literary work encompass in the all is the relationship uh, dispose in the uh, uh, in the com uh, uh, sense wall of the universal literary history where else could to ever to be a place in, in the course of connection uh, 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 and uh, uh, preparations that are it is a uh, reason ditre <clears throat> and another he uh, he argument was that the terms uh, term of comparative literature was uh, a futures uh, distinctions and the obvious uh, the obvious that uh, that is the fact uh, the fact is that the true object of his study was a literary history and another uh, another two uh, Uh, Max Koch, uh, founder and the editor of the two uh, German uh, comparative gen- uh, genres, uh, 
just with uh, for uh, uh, for uh, for uh, uh, veg, uh, for vegans which were in 1887 and 1910 and another se- uh, second uh, journal is a study and for Valgis uh, 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 Sende uh, uh, the literature gives a thin uh, 1901 uh, and 1999. Another uh, he claimed he could not uh, distinguish between a literary theory, pure and simple, and comparative literature uh, history. He, he, uh, we can see uh, we can see the cross uh, different views regarding comparative literature. That he is uh, against uh, towards the concept of the comparative literature. These uh, show various comparative literature. All literature difference uh, disappear when readers take up the great works. Art is uh, seen as a, a uh, as an instrument of a universal harmony, and the uh, comparist is a uh, one who uh, <coughs> faculties uh, to the uh, spread of spread of that uh, harmony and the an, uh, another uh, other scholar he the north american charles mill uh, Wisley, he the comparative uh, literature uh, program in the other year uh, other year uh, as a cross attack to the working premise of the student of comparative literature was the literature as a distant and uh, Integral medium of thought, a common uh, institutional uh, expressions of humanity, this intended to be the sure by the social condition uh, of the individual by uh, uh, by a racial, historical, culture, and linguistic influence, opportunity, and restrictions, uh, but the. Uh, Irrespective of the age of views uh, promeated by the common uh, needed and the apprehensions uh, of the men sprung from the uh, uh, common uh, faculties of the psycho, uh, uh, psychological and uh, and uh, philosophically and beyond the common law of material and modes of the individual and the social humanities. <clears throat> and the, uh, another other uh, other uh, critic he, he is the search of the methodology uh, and uh, Hennessy uh, argued that uh, the, the competitive literature is uh, some kind of the world uh, world religious and the underlying suggestion is the culture and another is the instrument of the universal harmony and the comparison one uh, Velek, uh, Velek and uh, Warren uh, say that the theory of the literature, a book that, uh, a book that uh, immorally significant in, in a comparative literature, when it first appeared in 1949, he suggests uh, that uh, comparative literature will make high uh, demand on type of linguistic uh, pro, uh, uh, proficiencies uh, of our scholar. It asks for uh, winding uh, for, for, for perspectives, uh, super, uh, super of a local and uh, pro uh, sentiments not easy to achieve. And another, he uh, both the st- uh, state that the literature is uh, one as the art and you, uh, humanity uh, are on. It is the idealistic vision that. Uh, uh, vision that uh, re- raised you uh, in the aftermath of a major international crisis. <coughs> and, uh, and another said the he says the the great uh, waves of the critical thought that the structuralism to to the post uh, structuralism from uh, feminism to deconstruction from seminology and uh, psychoanalysis uh, further uh, further discussion i call like the nitty dog Hello everyone, I am Nithi Dhawimbai. Uh, 
as we know that my topic is introduction introduction what is comparative literature today is a comparative literature is a very confused word that is ex, ex, extremely different word that, that's reason a very critics uh, view on their uh, various thought so now when we discuss about the first the critical Swapan Mazumdar. Swapan Mazumdar puts is it is a because of uh, this uh, uh, prediction for a national treasure must uh, developed by the Anglo-American critics as a methodology that uh, comparative literature has a uh, struck root in the third world, third world national and India's and is a particular. And also he is puts that uh, point out uh, that uh, Mm, Indian scholars call Western literatures uh, regardless of uh, geographical uh, positions include those literature which derive from the uh, Greece, Greece or Roman um, material via Christianity and his terms English, French, German and as a subnational uh, literature and he is uh, quite clear that we have uh, bringing to comparative literatures in his uh, from which he used a uh, radically alternative perspective and uh, revolution of the discussions of a national uh, literature. According to those uh, in the West are thinking uh, that uh, uh, terms of uh, great li literatures also majority versus uh, uh, minority literature. In the Indian perspective, uh, also Masmudar uh, suggested that now we uh, discuss about the other another Another the colonial critic Homi Baba. Homi Baba sum up his uh, essay uh, about uh, that uh, colonial culture how suggested instead of uh, cross uh, uh, refreshing, there is an uh, effective uh, production uh, cross cutting across uh, side of social significance and uh, ambivalence of uh, pro post colonial. Colonial. Instead of cross uh, referring, there is a effective, productive cross cutting across uh, site of social significant areas uh, and uh, dialectual uh, disciplinary sense of culture reference in uh, revelers. Also, the African critic also Inca and the whole race uh, there his view. Also, the another critic argued uh, that uh, Hegel, who argued that African culture was uh, weak in uh, contrast to what his uh, claim uh, were higher, more developed uh, culture and who were effectively defined by Africa as a uh, history. Uh, the now, James Need and his essay now he attacking of the Hegel that uh, the out. The outstanding fact of a late 20th century European culture is, is a ongoing uh, uh, recolonization with a black culture. The mystery may be that a look so long and uh, distant of element of a black culture already there in uh, Indian Latin form and the re realization that the separation between the culture and uh, was perhaps all along the one's nature but one of force. Also, uh, they say about that Africa, India, Caribbean critics have uh, also ch challenges the refu refusal of a great deal of a Western literary criticism to accept the implications of their literary uh, theory and uh, culture of policy. Also, the another uh, uh, critic, uh, Terry Eagleton, has argues uh, that uh, uh, literature in the meaning of the world we have inherited is an uh, ideology and he discussed the way in which the emerge of the English and uh, academic subject of uh, the 19th century and quite clear of uh, political implications. Also, Eagleton say about uh, the, his explanation of the rise of English and uh, they, they discuss about uh, some question like uh, literature or produce within the geographical uh, boundaries of England or uh, the United Kingdom or uh, literatures written in uh, English from all uh, uh, parts of the world and uh, where uh, does uh, the boundary lie between the on the literature on one hand and uh, popular the mass mass culture and other hand also they say about that 19th, 19th century that how English are emerged from the uh, from the Beowulf to the Virginia Wolves, then also uh, 
also uh, also they said about the work of edward said the pa pioneer of the national of orientalism but he provided many critics with a new vocabulary said uh, the another critic said he uh, said about their thesis that the orient the orient was a world which later uh, occurred to in the wide field of the meanings associations and uh, keno generations and that, he, the, that this did not necessarily refer to the real orient but the field of surrounding in the world also uh, the another uh, critic uh, jehang longski they uh, say about his work the myth of the other and the next word the china is the eyes of the west he says about that the west china is the land of the past fact becoming the traditionally the image of uh, ultimate and other and uh, he say that the challenge posed by the non european critics in the colonization nation systematic process of uh, inventing other cultures has put that ideology family back on the agenda by uh, literary studies then he say about the growth of the national uh, national english the growth of the national consciousness and the awareness of the need of the move beyond of the colonial legacy and he led off significantly and the development of a contemporary literature is the main part of the world uh, world even the subject enter at the period of the critics in uh, legacy in the west they uh, why which play the uh, competitive literature was immersed to that uh, uh, china brazil india or many african nation uh, now they talks about uh, another uh, another author that ganesh devis argumented competitive literature in india coincidence with the rise of a modern indian nationalism is uh, important because he Uh, so to the remind us to the origin of the term competitive literature in uh, europe a term that the uh, first appearance in the age of a uh, national struggle when the new boundaries were uh, begin uh, emerged in the world questions of the national culture and uh, national identity was uh, under discussion throughout the uh, europe and the uh, united states also he says about that competitive literature that is a begun and development development outside like uh, europe and united states is a uh, breaking a new ground and there is a great deal to be a uh, learned from following in this uh, development also development also what is the what is this but the competitive literature but the un, under another name now the, uh, he say about that uh, how uh, competitive literature are emerged and uh, called a new name that is the what is a translation study is a contribution to a competitive literature in the competitive uh, translation study is a emerge uh, in the ni- uh, 19 early emerged in mid 1917 the what is discussion the translation studies from the uh, translation as a traditionally throughout uh, is a dri- derivations from uh, psychology theory and development uh, by the uh, even zohar and the later uh, giordan tori and tel evi the comparative literature has uh, traditionally claimed translation is a sub category but these assumptions is now being questioned the work of a scholar such as tori uh, letrans hermans lambert and many others uh, shows that uh, translation is uh, especially significant as uh, a moment of uh, that uh, great cultural change the other that even and zohar argues that the uh, extensive translations activity takes place when a cultural is a, a period of a translation when it is expanding when it needs a uh, renewal when it is a pre revolutionary phase then the translations play a vital part in the constructs when a culture is solidly established when it is in a imperialization stage when is believed 
believe itself in dominant then translation is a less important then he last to conclude part he said that english become the language of international diplomacy in the 20th century and also there was a little need of a translation his relative probity of a 20th century translations into a english compared with the professional of a translation in many other languages and the competitive literature has always claimed that translation is a sub category but as a translation studies establishes itself humbly as a subject based in a intercultural studies and offering of a methodology in a some regular both in the uh, term of a theological and disciplinary work so competitive literature is appearance less like a discipline and more like a branch of the something else